Hey, what's up, guys? It's Russo and Jordy with Backdoor Fantasy Sports. It's August 19th, Monday, and we've got some MLB plays for you. Um, before we get started, if you haven't signed up for either of these platforms yet, uh, for prize picks, use the promo code at the bottom of the screen. They'll match your first deposit up to $100. And for underdog, use code BACKDOOR. You'll get a deposit match up to $250 and an instant pick em special, which is a discounted play to help you cash your first slip. There's a link in the description for both of these if you're looking to sign up for either of these platforms. And if you're new to the channel, make sure you subscribe and hit the notification bell. If you guys don't mind, give us a like. Uh, it just helps us get in front of a larger audience. We really appreciate you guys. And um, yeah, let's just get right into these plays. The plays I'm rolling with today, I'm going with two unders. Um, I like uh, TJ Friedel. Hope I'm saying his name right. Uh, but the 1.5 hits runs RBIs, feeling good about that uh, going under today, getting that on both platforms. And uh, Harrison Bader. Uh, I also feel good about his uh, 1.5 hits, runs, RBIs. Uh, taking the under on both of these. Uh, what are you getting into, Jordy? Yeah, I'm going to be taking uh, Tristan Cassis for over uh, 0.5 total bases. And then I'm taking Jonathan <clears throat> India for over 1.5 hits, runs, and RBIs. All right. Well, uh, if you guys are interested in gaining an edge on your daily fantasy uh, game, uh, definitely check out Daily Grind. They're a partner of ours. They make killer DFS tools. Um, we love the DFS optimizer. That's where I found both of my plays today. And you can get 25% off when you use code backdoor uh, at dgfantasy.com. There's a link in the description if you guys want to uh, check some of those out. And they will let you apply that discount for as long as you make your first subscription. So you can lock it in for a full year if you want, take advantage of football and uh, basketball coming up. Uh, but yeah, whatever you uh, first sign up for, you get that 25% off. So, um, all right. <clears throat> so TJ Friedel, I'm going to start there. So he's uh, he's gone over this uh, twice out of his last five games. Um, let's zoom that out a little bit. Um, he's only cleared this three times, though, out of his last 10. So he's gone under this seven times. Um, you know, I found this on the optimizer, was feeling good about it, hopped in outlier and uh, felt even better about it. Um, so here's a little additional note from outlier. Uh, Friedel has failed to exceed 1.5 hits, runs, RBIs in seven out of his last nine games. Uh, 1.3 is what he's been averaging. Um, the reason I felt comfortable with this is because it's not a lack of getting, uh, you know, the plate appearances. Averaging 3.9 um, over his last 10, and you can see the stretch of him getting to the plate um, pretty consistently at least four times. <clears throat> so the fact that he hasn't been producing obviously makes me feel a little bit better about taking this under. And um, if we hop over to the uh, optimizer here, I apologize, it's up here. Okay, here it is. So this is one of the top plays on the board for uh, prize picks today uh, for MLB. Um, they've got this uh, favor to go under. Uh, the odds to hit indicators at 53.49% odds to hit the under. The, the daily grind odds have this juiced all the way up at a minus 140. Um, and we see we've got 135 and higher um, favoring this to go under. So across the board, everyone that has this at 1.5 feels like this is gonna go under. So I'm feeling good about that. And on underdog, um, it's actually, uh, the under is uh, 0.9x. So I'm still taking the 0.9x, but that even tells you underdog uh, feels like it's more likely that he's gonna go under. So feeling good about that play. My next up, uh, Harrison Bader. I also feel good about this under. And um, similarly to uh, Friedel, he's only cleared this. He's only gone over this three out of his last 10 as well. Um, and uh, his, his plate appearance has been a little bit spotty, uh, which doesn't deter me, you know, um, 3.1 plate appearances on average over the last 10. And uh, you can see as of late, his uh, appearances have been going down a little bit. Uh, let's see this note. Um, same, pretty much the same thing. Outliers just letting us know seven out of his last eight games, he's gone under this uh, averaging 0.5. So feeling great about this play as well. Another optimizer play we found. Um, let's take a look. I know he's on here. Where are you at? I think he was down a little bit. Here we go. Uh, so they have this favor to go under at a 52.43% odds to hit the under minus 133, according to Daily Grind. Um, and then all of the other uh, platforms that have this, <clears throat> have it at like a minus 122 is, is the lowest odds we're seeing favoring the under, but a lot of these are minus 130, minus 135, even some minus 140s. Um, so I'm feeling good about just taking two unders today. 
Uh, if you guys want to check out this app outlier that just kind of helps you like vet your plays before you commit to them, um, there's a, a link in the description. Uh, just go through that link and then they're going to give you seven days to try it out for free. See if you like it. Um, they cover matchups, injury reports, insights about the players. Um, and it just really makes you feel a little bit more confident about what you're taking when you can see all of the data right there uh, on each player. Um, so yeah, that covers my plays. I'm going to pass it over to Jordy. Sweet. Yeah, man. So to get into my plays here, I'm going to be taking uh, Tristan Cassis for over this 0.5 total bases. Um, this play looks really, really good. I know um, some people are on this play for sure, but he's gone over this in 17 out of his 25 games he's played this year. So he's definitely been getting this done over the six out of his last seven head to heads. He's at least gotten one total base here. Uh, 15 out of his last 20 games and four out of his last five. So he's definitely been crushing this line on daily grind here it's a 51.18 percent chance to go over and a minus 125 so feeling pretty good about tristan here we're getting that on both platforms as well so feeling pretty good that we got both of these plays on both platforms um today thank god so uh next up we got jonathan india for over the 1.5 hits runs and rbis um he was off to kind of a uh, a good start this year and then he got into like a really weird lull for a little bit here but I've been watching him over the last couple games here. And then that KC Royals series, he really did uh, pretty good in that series. So um, I'm going to be taking a chance on him today in this series. Um, he's been struggling on the year for sure. He's only gone over this 55 out of 115 games this year. So if this play scares you a little bit, um, you don't have to take it. But I'm just going to try to hop on this one early because I think he's kind of getting back in his groove here. They're saying he's, uh, he said in the last game he's feeling a little bit healthier. So hopefully that's playing a factor. Um, so if we look at this one over here on daily grind, it's a 51.9% chance and a minus 130 to go over. So I feel pretty good about this play as well. I'm going to be taking a shot on Jonathan today. So, um, yeah, that's the two plays I've got for you guys and, uh, we'll pass it back to Russo here. All right. Well, um, we are talking about MLB. So if you guys do want to check out chalkboard, uh, you can bump the lines up and down and they have very generous multipliers. Uh, we're, we're really big fans of the chalkboard platform. Um, We've been working with them for a little while now and watching them expand because they're like a newer platform. Um, they are only available on Apple and Android right now, but it's totally worth it. Um, the, uh, the, the lines are awesome and uh, you can make plays for as low as a dollar. Uh, they run six specials a day minimum. Uh, so it's like every day is Taco Tuesday. But on top of that, um, on Tuesdays and Wednesdays, uh, sometimes they'll just throw a, a, a bunch of extra discounted props in addition to their daily six that they put out. Um, so yeah, when you uh, bump a line up on chalkboard, you get a higher multiplier for it. You're kind of in control of like creating your own demons and goblins. It's so much fun. So if you guys want to check that out, um, you can uh, just sign up through the uh, link in the description. Uh, but when you are making your first deposit, make sure that you've got the code backdoor in there and they're going to match your first deposit up to $100. Um, and if you guys want to come check out our Discord, we have a really killer community over here. We're all just getting stoked about football. We, we you know, we're counting down the days. Um, but the community works together. And um, if you guys want to come join us, uh, sign up through the Patreon link. Uh, Patreon's just managing our subscriptions for our Discord right now. So when you sign up through Patreon, go into settings um, and uh, then just connect your Discord. There's a connect uh, external apps option in their settings. As soon as you do that, it takes like two minutes. Uh, it'll unlock our, our Discord channel for you. You can come hop in the community chat. Let us know you're new so we can uh, get you set up and make sure you understand how to get the most out of the Discord. Um, so yeah, we hope you guys have a great start to your week. Thanks for tuning in and we'll catch you in the next video. Good luck, guys.